Hey, welcome back, guys. And uh, uh, this is your host, uh, Rafi of Tech Patrol News. And we have here David of Semicurrent.com. Uh, we have a, yep. a special guest. Kami kung mapapansin yun. Yep. Kasama kami. Yeah, Isang uh, tech person. blogger. <laughs> yep. Uh, si Mr. Denison. Ang uh, nagbablog sa astig.ph. Yep. Bro, pakilala ka naman sa mga audience okay. natin. Hey guys, so I'm the editor-in-chief of astig.ph. It's a technology, entertainment, and lifestyle blog. I am the one who handles the technology, technology reviews. So, ayun, just like my friends David and Rafi mentioned, this is the Flash Plus 2. Two. So, ayun, the Flash Plus 2. Two. Um, when David said it's online only, this means that it's not available in brick and mortar stores. Hindi yung hindi mo siya mabibili sa malls. Sa malls, sa sa Green Hills. Oh. Sandali na win yun. Yes. Sa Lazada lang ito, guys. Correct. And you guys know how much this costs, right? Correct. Kano, Kano, mura lang. Uh, una, unahan na natin. Price. Six. No, no, no. Eight, four. There are two versions kasi. Mm. Kaya medyo na nag, uh, nagtigil ako doon. The first version is the 16 gig and... Um, 16 gig and 32 16 gig version. 16 gig internal storage yeah. and 2 gigs of RAM. Correct. The second variant has 32 gigs of internal storage and 3 gigs of RAM. Correct. So this one that we have right here. This is the 16 gig version. 16 gig and version. this is the retail uh, price of this is only 6,999. Yes. Uh, and 6,990. Well, correct. 6,990. 6,990. And the 32 gig version is also very affordable. 8,490. Yep. Pero pero para malinaw lang sa mga viewers natin, mm -hmm. parehas na bang available yung mga models? No, not yet. Uh, according to Flash, uh, the first model to be released in the Philippines is the 16 gig muna. And then a month later, they will release the 32 gig. Kaya lang ba yun ni-release? Na-release na yun uh, I think the yesterday. Flash sale was yesterday. It was yesterday. Yeah. So very fresh. Kumusta na kaya yun? No? Parang hindi tayo nakapalita sa so very fresh. Bali, inuna pala. Inuna yung 2 gig version. Uh, inuna yung version na may 2 gig RAM at yep. 16 gig na storage. Mm -hmm. Ni-release siya for 699. For 699. And then next month, may lalabas na bago which is yung 3 gig RAM and 30. 32 gig storage. Okay. How much ulit? 8,490. 8,490. Okay. Ano bang uh, features nitong Flash Plus 2 maliban doon sa storage na napag-usapan natin? Okay, so first of all, yung pinagmamalaki ni Flash is the all-metal body. This is, the back cover is all-metal. It's it's built using aluminum. And if you'll see the Flash logo, it's... Uh, parang naka-engrave oh, siya. Parang naka-engrave siya. Ang ganda guys. I mean, I don't know if you can appreciate it. Anong sa video. Ito? Silver ba ito? I have the silver model. Pero yung usong-uso ngayon, di ba? You have yeah. silver, uh, gold. May gold. Ah, may gold. Oh, nice. so, rose gold. Kaso ito, wala yata itong rose gold. <laughs> oh, dalawa lang, silver and gold. Yeah. Mm. Tapos, it also has a 13 megapixel camera mm -hmm. with uh, dual LED flash. Right. Wala siyang image stabilization though. And at the bottom, you have the built-in loudspeaker. Speaker. Uh, um, sa harap naman. Ano sa harap naman. Parang nakita ko yung screen niya is 5.5 inch, di ba? Yes, tama ka bro. The screen is 5.5 inches, no Gorilla Glass. Um, so you have to install a screen protector. I guess protector. it's expected na oh, for, for the price. For the price, man. 6,990, walang Gorilla Glass. Oh, Pero 5.5 inch, uh, full HD screen, di ba? Full HD yes, screen. Yes, full yeah. HD screen. 1,920 by 1,080 pixels. Mm -hmm. And then the home button that you see right here, it's physical. The reason why it's physical is because it's, it also acts as a fingerprint sensor. At sobrang bilis niya, guys. So, yun yung bago sa Flash Plus. This is the first version of no fingerprint scanner. Flash, no, no, wala, yeah. wala. So, Flash Plus. Um, so, ito yan, pag pinindot ko to, maraming uh, fingerprint. Kasi, mo finger. Correct. Okay. Pero, kung ako, uy, mag fast. Mag fast. Uh, yeah. Oh, it's a bit. 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 It's a bit.
And ay, teka. Uh, you have to you have to Make Ito sure. yung yeah. uh, napansin ko dito, you can't unlock it if you, the screen, screen isn't oh, kung patay yung screen, you have From to turn it on mode, you cannot turn it on. You cannot. Right. And then you Interesting. Saka mo siya iaano, ayan oh, no, i-unlock. So you see what happened? Yes, it went directly. Tama ka, bro. It went directly to the calculator. Kasi it's enrolled. I enrolled it so that it automatically shortcut opens. Na siya. Oh, shortcut na siya. So it's parang... actually one of the selling feature of this phone. You can configure <laughs> up to five, five apps to automatically launch using a fingerprint. Correct. So, uh, ginagamit mo na to for the past week. Yes, I've been using it for the entire duration of our trip here in Taiwan. Mm -hmm. So, ano sa tingin mo sa kanya? Ano sa mo sa I think it's a very good um, entry-level device. Because, mm -hmm. um, well, not really. Because the specs are parang mid-range. Mid actually, eh. right? Oh, so the the price is entry-level. Right. But um, it's really fast because uh, this this device has a Helio P10 mm. processor. That's oh, the mid-range mid -range processor oh, of MediaTek. Media Media Meron so, siyang uh, octa-core, di ba? Octa-core na yun? Yes, octa-core. Uh, mid-range na GPU. So, kung gamer ka, pwede pa din. Correct, correct. And yeah. I've been um, I've been playing with it. I've been using it to... So, abe, mabilis, ha? Um, yes, I've, I've been using it actually as a hotspot. Correct. So, we bought a uh, Taiwanese SIM, SIM card. Um, and we entered it to the Flash, Flash Plus 2 and I use it as a hotspot. And I'm able to surf the entire day using the phone. So, so, um, so very, pa, ano siya, very reliable siya. Kasi yung, the, the battery life is very long. Um, By the way, the, this, the, the battery of this is 3,000 mAh. 3,000 mAh battery. It lasts yep. the entire day. So, Alam niya naman, di ba, pag naka-mobile data ka, ang lakas makadrain ng battery. Lalo na kung naka-hotspot ka. Di ba, lalo na kung naka-hotspot ka pa kasi kinakain niya yung Wi-Fi pati yung, set, yung mobile data mo. Wait, what, what about the, the, the camera? I'm, 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 a, I'm a camera okay. guy. So. 13 MP daw. Okay, eh. well, front-facing camera is 13 yeah. megapixels. And the, um, oh, the rear, the rear, the rear, the rear camera. Front-facing camera. How is it? Um, 5, 5MP. 5, 5 but it's a flash. The uh, rear has a LED flash. The uh, front din, also has an din. LED flash. So let's try it so you can see it. So we're, we're just going to take a selfie. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> so ayan, um, what I good? like, uh, the camera is pretty average for me. Uh, okay. For me, there are smartphones out there with better cameras. Mm -hmm. But um, what I like about it is the white balancing. Kung ma mapapansin mo, di ba yung color natin ngayon medyo manilaw. Oh. Pero yung timpla ng kulay niya, ah, di ba? Medyo tama, di ba? Medyo accurate. Pwede natin sa kanila yan para ma- So we'll, we'll, set, we'll post this video. I'll send you guys a copy of this video. Correct. And that's one of the things that I noticed. Tapos yung quality niya medyo sharp naman siya. Um, considering it doesn't have optical image stabilization, sharp siya. Um, it's uh, it's comparable it's to mid-range cameras. I can name other brands that have comparable cameras. Um, for me, it's good. And for me, yung selling point talaga nito is that it has flash dun sa front-facing camera niya. Yes, pang selfie. And it's very wide angle. Although, there are also, again, other smartphones that have wide-angle cameras. Still, this is a good camera for me. And you can use it to shoot videos and take good photos. So, I'm gonna take a photo right now. Ayan. So, medyo low light tayo. Diba? So, it's fast. It's fast. Oh, uh, it's fast naman. Fast focusing. So, take a look at the results. Medyo fuzzy na siya. Medyo fuzzy ng konti. Pero, That's maganda pa rin. Understandable. Low light naman. Low light. Oo. Oh, oh. Okay. So, uh, very, uh, well, let's make it, uh, wrap it up na lang. Uh, would you recommend the Flash Plus 2? Definitely, I will recommend the Flash Plus 2 for anyone who is budget conscious. Kasi sobrang value for money niya, guys. I mean, 7,000 pesos. Correct. <laughs> being Helio P10. Being this uh, affordable ba? Ganun. Oh. Affordable I mean, and 
alam mo kahit uh, nagbago siya ng branding it's already it's uh, it has become flash but we know that it's still uh, backed up by Alcatel it's still backed up by Alcatel yes. so, yeah. Okay, so there you go. Uh, there you have it. Uh, Shayong expert, and he's been using the phone. I, I, I'm inclined to agree. Uh, but maybe may other opinion kayo about the Flash Plus. Share nyo sa amin. Comment nyo na lang sa video. And uh, kung gusto nyo pang makita yung mga gawa ni uh, paring Dennis, punta kayo sa vlog niya. Stick that page. Hey, Ipapusa na namin yung mga links sa description ng video. Thank you very much for joining okay. us today. Thanks, bro. Thank you, bro. Thank you, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> thank you for helping us out in this episode. And thank you for watching. Thank you, watchers. Thank you.